Hi, everybody. Let's try this afternoon shopping and see how that goes. Hi, Phyllis. Okay. <laughs> Put this out to a few people. Get back to where I need be. This is just going to be kind of a fast, quick little show. I'm not going to give you a lot of details on items. I'm just going to show them. If you want to see anything extra about them, if I don't show them on my wrist or my fingers or on the bus and you'd like to see that, then that's fine. Every item is just $5. In case you can't make my nighttime shows, I thought I'd try some daytime ones. And um, maybe if littles, moms have little kids and everything and they're taking naps, maybe they'd have more of an opportunity to watch during the day than the night. Um, so, yeah. So, uh, these are just pieces I put together. Most of them, I've just, well, all of them I've done on my own. But some are are actual matching pieces and so um, I won't separate them but uh, almost everything I will sell separate if you like one item uh, but you don't like both that's fine but like this very first one this is a matching set so this is going to be number 23 if you're interested in an item just write down the number or say you know, number 23 in the comment. Some people write down the numbers and wait until the end of the show to see everything. So I have in total 32 piece sets, but I'm only going to show 15 today and then I'm going to show 15 on Wednesday. So if you don't see something that you like today, maybe you will um, uh, on Wednesday. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and get started. Like I say, it's just a quick little thing. I'm going to do this for a little bit this month and see how it goes. Number 23 for this two-piece set, ruby red earrings in, encased in the silver, a long, delicate little chain. And then you have this ruby red piece, and it keeps twisting around. Let me see if I can get it to sit still. There you go. So the outside part, the larger oval, is just little silver, little bump, bumpy parts on there. And then you've got the, the ruby reds and then the little crown pieces inside of there. And then these are matching earrings. The, they're the exact piece. So I actually had this one place and got this from another place. And they match exactly, so I don't want to break this up. But those are ruby red crystals. This is a long necklace that's going to come below your breast line, number 23. 23 for this one. This next one is 20, uh, 72. Hi, Sherry. Trying something new today. Number 72. For this next one, this is a hot pink stretchy bracelet. Like I say, I can break these up. This is four strands of these beautiful hot pink beads. Love the color. This strand is the hot pink with the little silver ones. This has the hot pink with the few silver ones, but then it has the cylinders on here that stretches around. This one has a couple of ornate silver beads with a little heart in the middle and then the infinity sign. That's number three. And then this last one just has the infinity sign by itself. So, you know, you could wear all four of these together. You could wear two on each arm. You could wear this with something, two with something else, however you'd want to do it. Okay, everything's $5. And then I put this ring with it. 
Now it's a little bit redder than the bracelet, but I think it still goes really good. Like I say, you can be, buy one or the other on this. 72 72 for this four straight, just the bracelet, you know, alone is pretty. That's a good bargain for $5 for those four bead filled necklace there. Okay, this one is going to be 59, number 59. This is a pretty, pretty shade of purple. Very vibrant, like a hot purple. You know how they say hot pink, but this to me looks like hot purple. Has two strands that comes down. Hot purple little discs there. Then you have the silver hammered ones all the way down. And this is layered. And at the bottom one is just a little longer than the other on you. Again, this would come down um, to the bottom of your breast on this one. And then I put this with it because I think this bracelet is really pretty because it has that hot purple in there. But it also has shades of pink, pink purple, purple pink, and there's some little um, silver beads on there you see. They're all like a round, but they have some um, some different, it's not just a circle. They're like hammered out a little bit to make them flat on certain sides. But I think that goes good with this because uh, it has some of the same exact shade in it. So I think that makes a good set. Number 59 for this one. 59. This one is going to be 80. And same thing applies um, like during the night, if you like uh, something, just hit the hearts. You can tag people to come in. This two-piece set is number 80. This is a latch and extender bracelet. Pretty blue. It's a true blue on this one. And then the little pieces that have all of those little crystals in that make it just a little blingy. And I think these earrings go perfect with that. These earrings are not very long at all. I have two pairs of these earrings too. If somebody wants the set and somebody else just wants the earrings, I do have two pairs of the earrings. Number 80, number 80 for this set of the blue. Next one will be 99, number 99 coming up. These are plum beads. They're just the little, the earrings are just the little ball beads. They were crossed there, so. I love this shade. It's a plum color. Especially for fall, the richer colors really come in. So it's just the medium chain. It's an asymmetrical necklace, so each side does not match. It has the medium beads, the small beads, the larger beads in that plum color. And then it has several of these circles just every once in a while. I think there's three of them on here. And this chain comes up and is just a chain, the one with the beads, and then the bottom one. So it's a layered necklace. And then these earrings are the same exact beads in the same exact color. Goes with it perfectly. That makes a really nice set because you have the earrings and the necklace close to you. You can see all at once. Even if you have a different bracelet and a ring. But these have the circles, two circles, one with the one bead in and then the other one's dangling off. And these earrings go down to uh, between your mouth and your chin. Okay. So this set goes together very well. Number 99. If not for you, even for somebody for Christmas maybe. That likes the purple. Because that's a rich purple. Wine color. Plum color. Number 79 on this one. Number 79 on this next one. This is a 
blue bracelet with little discs. It has the extender and it has the latch hook. The little medallion with the blue in the center on this bracelet and then this ring that goes with it. It matches pretty closely. If I put that on together, it matches pretty closely. Like I say, you don't have to buy both. You can buy one or the other. If you like one and don't like the other, I just threw pieces together. Number 79. 79 for that one. You guys be sure to check out my video I posted too. I posted a video about uh, with some of my open cuff bracelets. So I'm trying videos, I'm trying afternoon shows, I'm really trying to um, build up my clientele and trying different times of the day and night. Sh share with your friends if they're home during the day. Number 22 for this next set. These are really interesting, pretty earrings. You have the lavender ones on the outside. You have the silver work. And then you have the inside darker purple. And the darker purple on the inside goes with this ring. The exact same color on the large stone and on the outside that has those elongated teardrops. Okay, this is number 22. I wanted to see maybe how, let me check to see how this ring goes with the plum set I just showed. You could wear this with those as well. So you know I have the necklace and I have the earrings, so here's a ring. I'm not so sure about um, a plum, let me see. Yeah, I don't see a plum bracelet over there. But but this ring would also work with the with the set that's 99. But this is set number 22. Number 22 for the earrings and the ring. Number 22. 94 is a shop, uh, shiny copper set. And I want to see, yeah, something else too, because I may have a different ring rather than the one that I have with it that might go with it better. I'm not sure. We can try. These are the little crystals that are encased in the copper and it makes it look like the white crystal beads are actually topaz. Here's the shiny copper long necklace that comes down and this is like this is like a little basket. You know the baskets that you put outside or some people put them inside and you put dried flowers in and they're kind of wicker baskets. That's what this reminds me of. You see, because it's hollow inside, I think it's kind of cool. And this is a pretty bale. You see the little crystals in the middle here of this bale part? It's really pretty. And this is the ring I put with it. Okay, because it also kind of has that kind of netting effect. Or a spider web kind of look. I think that ring goes really well with it. I looked at those earrings, though, and um, thought I had a copper ring that might go with that. Oh, it's not shiny copper. It's regular copper. So, yeah, this will be a better fit for it. So, again, shiny copper ring and the necklace. I love shiny copper. If you don't have any of these pieces, you should try them. I tried them and I fell in love with them. Number 94 for this set. Okay, we are, that was number 8 of the 15, so we're halfway through. This one's number 60. Number 60 for this one. This has the long tassel earrings, the little chain that comes down 
there is the little oval with all of just white crystals and then you have the ruby red in case look at the facets on that how it catches the light and then you have the tassel on the end that matches the tassel earrings okay so this would probably come down uh, about the middle of your breast would be the red the red stone about the middle of your breast on that and then I have a latch hook and extender with these large links bracelet and same facets as on the necklace that would look really good with this okay number 60 for this one 60 I have a matte finish red necklace coming up number 39 this has a matching bracelet and let me put this one on the bust just because of how it lays sometimes I can hold them up and you get an idea but sometimes they need to be on the bust I need to see how it's got a piece of the chain stuck inside I don't want to break it Here we have a little technical difficulty actually it's a mechanical there it came out Okay, yay. I really wanted to show you this. This is a deeper red, again, with fall right now. This reminds me of fall colors on the leaves. Not bright red, but that deep red color. Isn't that pretty? So you have the deep red little earrings up there kind of shine a little bit and then look at all this this actually looks to me like falling leaves anyway the way it cascades down like that latch hook extender bracelet and the color matches that exactly so this is number 39 beautiful color for fall Number 39 for that one. Okay, this set is number 66 and it's hot pink. Really, really pretty hot pink. Really nice. Now this is a, uh, this opens hinge, but it goes back behind the stone. Okay, so that's how you wear it. You just pull it open, you put it on, and then you close it back up. And I put it on backwards. There we go. <laughs> that's how it is. It's not too big on your wrist. There's plenty of room. I have a seven inch wrist. And then this pretty little pink ring. If you wear that with that, together look how pretty and cute that is pop of hot pink on this one number 66 66 on that set okay so this will be another one that I will not break up because the bracelet and the necklace match exactly they're a matching set number 45 hi Sheila we're doing just a quick little show here. I'm on probably number 10 or 11 of 15. It's like a little flash show. Not a lot of detail, just enough to show you what I have. And then I'll be doing uh, 15 more on Thursday. I mean, Wednesday afternoon. Wednesday afternoon. Okay, number 45 for this set, guys. This is a matching set. And Sheila, if you want, I can go back through these because there's there's not very many of them. Pretty little pink, peachy earrings. This is a short little necklace, but it has an extender. Okay, it has this uh, small link chain, has little gray faceted beads. It has little 
ones that like are a light lavender. It has little tiny brown ones, and then it has ones that are the same color as the earrings. You see all? I'm trying to get it to stop moving. There. All those different beads on there. Okay? And then you have the latch hook and the extender bracelet that matches. This is a matching set on this one. I will not break this set up. Number 45. Number 45 for this one. I think you guys have seen this before. Number 98. These are just all my two-piece sets I have left. Number 98 for this. Aqua blue. Love this color. And then you've got the textured little gray balls. I wouldn't have thought of putting those those together. But you know, teal and blue, I mean teal and gray are a great color combination. So is teal and brown. But these are more aqua. And I love that. So this is the bracelet. And this is the necklace. The necklace has the matching little balls that go with the bracelet and the matching little balls that go with the with the necklace here and again you have those gray little balls and you have some shiny ones and textured ones i think i have like three of these necklaces but i only have the one bracelet i love this aqua color Number 98, 98 for this set. Number 98, only two left, guys. And then anybody that came on, if you wanna see what I showed before you came on, that's fine, because I've only been on like a little over 20 minutes. This, these are gonna be little flash sales when I have them in the daytime. Number eight, number eight for this next set. This is a beautiful hot pink set has the little cherry-like earrings. This is like pinkish red, hot pink. They're the exact same designs on both sets. Just one layer uh, strand on here shorter than the other to make it a layered look. And then this, I also won't break this one up because this is the exact matching bracelet. It has um, these beads on here, the silver ones match these on here. You have different kinds of the silver beads, but it matches these right here with kind of wavy little beading on here. Matches exactly, will not break this up either. Number eight, eight for that set. And then one more guys, number 74. 74 for this last set. This is pretty blue. It's like a blue green. Okay. Here are the ball earrings to this necklace. It comes down on the little chains. This is symmetrical. You've got a strand of these strand, strand, then chain, strand, chain all the way around. And then at the bottom, it has the curtain effect like this. I think I showed a black one like this the other night. But this is a blue one. Blue, blue, red. Blue, pink, I mean. Blue, green. One of those color combinations. And this, this ring, I think, goes with it really well. With all that little scroll work on there. Let me take it down here to maybe the bottom a little bit so you can see it because there's different shades of this blue and green on here. But if you only want the necklace or you only want the ring, that's good too, okay? So number 74 for that set, number 74 for that set, okay? So that's half of my two-piece sets. I'll show the other half on uh, Wednesday afternoon at two. And if anybody has any questions or you want to see anything, and Sheila, you came on kind of late. Um, so if you want to see 
what I showed before you came on, then let me know because I can go through it really quick again. I have purples, I have pinks, I have reds, I have blues, I have lavenders, I have shiny copper, reds, pinks. Yep, got a little bit of everything. All right, anybody want to see anything again or have any questions or see it a little longer, closer, anything like that? Okay, well, if not, uh, make sure you go back uh, in today and look at the pictures uh, that were left after last night's show. I posted an album of those, and I also did a short video on uh, open cuff bracelets. So you can look at those and share with your friends, okay? So I'll see you guys tomorrow night at um, 9 o'clock again on the show. All right? All right? If you need anything else, just PM me. I'm here. All right? You guys have a good rest of your day and night. Bye.